Hey everyone, I'm Matt. Welcome back to another video. Today, I am super excited. We are taking a look at one of the best small class A diesel pushers on the entire RV industry. This one being one of Andrea's absolute favorites. This is the 2023 Fleetwood Fortis Model 34 GT. We are gonna be taking a look at the outside features first, then the inside features, then. We're gonna give you three things we love about the Fleetwood Fortis and three things we dislike about it. We're starting in three, two, one. Hey everyone again, welcome back to another video again today. I am super excited to be taking a look at this beautiful Fleetwood Fortis Class A diesel pusher. Before I begin, gotta say hi to Andrea. Hey Andrea! Hey everybody! How's it going today? It's going really good. I love these Frontiers. In fact, wait till you guys see it, it is gorgeous. Did I call it a Fortis a second ago? No, I think you said Frontier. Okay, good, good, yeah. good. Well, I'm super excited, Andrea, because they really are beautiful Class A diesel pushers. Let's begin! Model is Fleetwood Frontier 34 GT. Andrea, I think I might have called it a Fortis. I don't remember. The actual tip, tip length is 35 feet 4 inches. This sits on the custom Freightliner XCR chassis, which means it's raised rail. It has a 340 horsepower Cummins engine with 700 pound feet of torque, and the fuel capacity is 100 gallons. Andrea, this is an awesome diesel pusher motorhome now it's not quite entry level but it's also not super high-end level so it's that perfect combination of what a lot of people are looking for of quality and price and still being only 35 feet long very nice right up front here we do have a nice big front windshield mobile eye collision mitigation and everything and then right underneath here Andrea is an Onan generator look Onan diesel generator look at the headlight design I freaking love this what 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 do you see when you look at this? I see Zelda. Don't you see Zelda? <laughs> Zelda. Zelda, yeah. Oh, do you mean oh. the Nintendo game? Yeah, like the elf or whatever. Oh, right there. interesting. Right, like elf ears. I think it looks absolutely fantastic. I love the way Fleetwood did this, and it looks great. Coming on down the side here, we do have black mirrors integrated on both sides, and there is cameras integrated in the mirrors. Coming on down, we do have a front bus style door frameless windows throughout the whole motorhome, a door awning and an armless awning on the slide out. What is nice about that awning is uh, if the wind blows too hard, it will automatically retract itself back in. And then look at these tires, Drain and the Michelins. I love those. 275-80R, 22.5 with shiny AccuRide rims. I did mention it's a 100 gallon fuel fill up that you can fill up on both sides. Ooh. And then check out this storage. Very nice. I like the doors on here. Yeah, really big doors. I really like how they do it here. Oh, excuse me, Andrea. Bet you didn't know that. I forgot. Look at that. That is absolutely huge. And then right over here, we have a little bit of more storage. No slide out trace, which is a little surprising. We got a nice TV there. Let's see. Very, very nice Samsung TV that's huge on the outside. And go. All right. Finishing up, Andrea. Coming on down, we have right over here is your electronical components, your jabroni awning system, magnum inverter, everything that you want right there. Over here, here's where um, your hydraulic reservoir is. Again, the other side of the inverter and everything. And then coming around the back, Andrea, we do have a... 10,000 pound hitch. Now, it doesn't mean this motorhome can tow 10,000 pounds. You're good at six, seven, eight thousand pounds. Any more than that, you always, before you tow anything, weigh your motorhome, take the GCWR from the GVWR, and that's going to tell you how much you can tow. But, Andrea, what is nice about this, it does have the air, the air right there, so you can have like a stacker trailer or Air Force One brakes. Very nice. Really awesome rear Look cap. Look at that. Look at that paint design. Beautiful. Backup camera there. It does have a ladder for the one piece TPO roof, but it's the connection ladder. And Andrea, I ain't doing it no more. <laughs> I don't blame you. I ain't climbing ladders like that. No I more. don't blame you. And Matt. even if I wanted to, I don't even think I'm tall enough to make that connection. Right. You know what I'm saying? 
but I truthfully do love the way the Frontier looks. Look at the logo and everything while driving down the road. This is awesome. It looks pretty mean. But beautiful. Mean, but, but beautiful. Mean, but like, no, like, like get you. out of my way. Oh, <laughs> I'm not mean. <laughs> Look at these batteries, Andrea. Nice battery bank. Oh, man. I'm oh, more batteries. More batteries. DEF. 50 amp power cord on Love an electric it. reel. Andrea, that's what I look for in a motorhome, especially a diesel motorhome. Has a V ride, Matt. Yes. And then coming on down, here's our wet bay. Wow. Paper towel holder, potable water fill. Potable. Potable. City water connection, black tank flush. Beautiful. That's where you're dumping your tanks. Outdoor shower. Everything you want's right here, Andrea. I freaking love that. Just beautiful. Yes, ma'am. And then this is the other side of that awesome storage. Okay. Very nice. Right here, Andrea. The 250D hydronic heating system. And you know what that means? That means there's no propane on this coach. But, Miss Andrea, Miss Jen, bing! Please put all the specs of this motorhome right there so everybody can see who's watching on television. The other side of the fuel fill up. And then here's your blinker fluid. <laughs> right there. All right. Well, Andrea, the outside of this motorhome looks great, but the inside looks even better. Let's go take a look. Oops, okay. All right. Cargo carrying capacity is gonna be pretty good, I would think. I would imagine. Okay, look at this. Okay, so both slides are in. It's opposing slides, so you don't have a lot of walkway here. So I kind of have to turn to the side to get through. 7,226 pounds. That's crazy. Okay, it does open up a little bit more through here. I mean, you could definitely use the restroom with the slide in. Let me see if we can open the refrigerator. Um, just a little bit, you can get in and out of it. And then I'm turning to the side to get here to the bedroom, which the bed looks like a tilt -a bed I think, yeah. So you cannot use that with the slide in. Okay. Hey, Andrea, while we're getting the slide out, Sal, let's give a huge shout out to the sponsor of this episode. Everyone, it is RV show season. Over the next couple weeks, there's gonna be thousands of RVs that are sold nationwide. And there is one thing in common that every motorhome, travel trailer, fifth wheel, and every type of RV have in common. They all have crummy mattresses. Matt, why is that? It's because the RV manufacturers make thousands of RVs every year. And they know even if they put the right style of mattress, the average customer is just gonna take it out and put their own mattress in anyway. Here's the confusing part. You can't just go to your local furniture store and say that I have a Fleetwood Bounder and get the right RV mattress for your motorhome. So that's where our friends at RVMattress.com come in to save the day. They make mattresses that is specifically designed for RVs. So you go on the website, you find your different type of firmness that you like, and you find the exact size. Maybe it's 60 by 80 or 70 by 80. Not all king size beds are the exact same size. Once you select the right size and firmness, all you do is click it and they'll ship it to your home or campground. The best part about it, it's free shipping, you get a 120 night sleep child, and it's 100% made in the USA. Here's the three best mattresses that I recommend. First up is the Dream Foam Hybrid Mattress, which is engineered by one of the most advanced fabrics on the market, typically reserved for luxury beds to deliver cooling relief on contact. Next up, the Brooklyn Signature Hybrid. Can I get a hashtag best mattress ever? It's their number one selling mattress for one reason. The Brooklyn Signature combines individually encased ascension coils with patented hyper-responsive foam to increase comfort and deeper compression support. And then finally, my favorite, the Aurora Lux Advanced Cooling Technology in a Luxury Hybrid. That was the absolute best mattress that Andre and I had in our motorhome, and it was absolutely fantastic. Click the link down below and use our promo code MAT for 20% off, and again, Thank you so much to RVMattress.com backslash Matt of Brooklyn Bedding Company. Let's continue the video. Andrea, isn't this a beautiful motorhome? This is just gorgeous. It truthfully is. We're getting started up front in the cockpit area. Andrea, 
Freightliner, XCR, air ride suspension, I freaking love it. Cup holders right here, power mirrors. You got your mobile eye collision mitigation, digital dash, tire pressure monitoring system. And check this out, no push button start. You still have a key start. Right over here we got our cameras, mobile eye, um, camera screens and everything. Right over here, it's here's your heat control. Blinds, keyless entry, lock unlock, very, very oh, nice. This is so comfortable. How do you feel? I, I hands down, like they make really comfortable chairs. Oh yeah. There's a footrest here. Okay. Step cover here. Yes, ma'am. And then um guys, I have a cup holder right here. Yeah. Electrical outlet I see. This is so comfortable. Nice. Both seats do swivel, so you do have extra seating. And then let's see above here we've got some storage. Yes. Oh, well, there's some customers. Cool. Hang on, they just picked up their uh, Discovery Beautiful. 38W. And then uh, here's a TV. Yep. On the other side here, we've got some storage. Very nice. And then Andre, we do have a very nice bunk over the cab. But first, let me show you this. So you got your auto leveling here, and then here's where you can control some of your slide outs in your awning as well. Uh-oh, we don't have the key in the Euro loft. It's okay, bunk over the cab, Andre. Everybody knows what it looks like. It does come all the way down. It holds 500 pounds. It's the height aloft. There's a and, ladder that goes there. Yep. And then over here, Andrea, very nice. We do have cabinetry above. Love the cabinetry in the front here, don't you? They always do such an amazing job with their decor. Yes, ma'am. And uh, let oh, me see. Check out these valances. Check them out, Andrea. Approved. Bing. Oh, very good. Very pretty. Mindy. She does amazing at her decor. Mindy. I can't imagine because I would just be like choosing so many different things. Who knows how I would decorate one. We talked to Mindy who does all the yes. interior design for Rev Group. Fleetwood Hottie Rambler American Coach. Shout out. You do an amazing job. I can't wait until you do a horrible job <laughs> because we're going to let you know because she's like, she's on a point. Tech. She's on point Always. every time. Right here is our MCD privacy blinds and daytime blinds and then Andre I'm, I'm sitting here right in this electric recliner you got your cup holders here tons of storage right here and then it looks like even remote holders right there very very nice now over I, here I do want to touch on this look just look how detailed the decor is here it's just really really interesting pretty pattern LED lights in here when you open it up so nice not only that we got a fireplace right there what is nice about this fireplace, it does produce heat from electricity. And then even a little bit more storage there. You know why, Andrea? Because you can never have enough. Never, never, never. And then over here, sound bar. And then look how deep, well not that. Look how deep that storage goes back there. Wow. Don't drop something small back there. Right. Look at that. Very, very nice. And then there's one more right over there. And it looks like we have a TV on a televator it there. It does, and I don't know where the button is. Um, it's probably, you would think oh, it's it would probably, be over here. Oh, oh there, it, there is. it is in the corner. So here we go. So right over here, oh, you push this button, and then it goes all the way up. Now, Matt, I'm going to go over this QR code right here. Yes, ma'am. In case you guys want to check that out at the website. Yes, ma'am. And while that's coming up, I just want to show the dinette because it tr it really is a very comfortable dinette. It sure it's is. It's like the most comfortable, I think, in the industry because of the springs they put in there. It feels like you're sitting yes, on a sofa. Exactly. Not only that, this drops down and that lays flat, so it does become another sleeper area. And then you do have storage right there. And then I'll show you, just like that, the TV's up. And again, it's directly across from the theater seats right there. Fan freaking fantastic. Fireplace, storage, theater seats, everything. Andrea, do you know what time it is? It's, it's now time, time for, for the, the MSRP. MSRP. Burr, 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 burr. MSRP on this motorhome here is $397,789. Andrea, MSRP, we have it currently discounted 23% uh, off to $304,995. Andrea, that's a phenomenal price. But I'm confident we are Rev Group's number one dealership. 
So I'm confident we can get everybody a little bit of a better price than that. So if you guys are interested in buying one of these units, go to generalrv.com slash Matt's Cash. I've linked it down in the YouTube description below. You can get to it from mattsrvreviews.com or you can call 844-969-4033. However you have to get in contact with us, please do. And we will be able to get everybody the absolute best price in America. And those customers told me what they just paid for that discovery and it was fan freaking tastic. You know why, Andrea? Because that's what we do with Fleetwoods, you know what I'm saying? That's right. We're, 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 we're here to make everybody fantastic deals. Wow. Show us this beautiful kitchen. You know, I would have done the same thing in here. I would have picked blue. Yep. I, I totally, it's so pretty. Look at the backsplash. It's so nice. Okay, look at this really pretty frosted cabinetry here with adjustable shelf. Yes, ma'am. Love those. <laughs> look at the solid surface countertop. Beautiful. Gorgeous with the farmhouse sink. Yes. <laughs> Love that. Good extension there. Yes, ma'am. Very, very pretty. Right. And then underneath, we have, oh! Hey! Nice! That's a $156 trash can. It might be more than that, Matt. <laughs> All right, so Fleetwood's giving out trash cans now. And then over here, we have an Insignia convection microwave. So nice. Two burner induction cooktop. Very nice. Yes, ma'am. And then we got some drawers here. Look at that. Very nice. Oh, good size. Right. And then a bigger one down here. So nice. And then behind you, what's this? Little pantry, I guess. Nope. Okay, that's your fuse box. And then Luma here. Flex. Okay. I yeah, guess that is your little pantry. A little bit. Oh, nope, I think there's more. Of course there is. Andrea, <laughs> Art Deco. Um, no. Oh. But it's still cute. I like the double colored walls. Yes, very pretty with their chair rail. And then here we've got the LG uh, residential. Oh no, sorry, compressor refrigerator. Oh, wow. Weird. Look at wow. that. Very wow, nice. I have not seen this yet with the drawers. Yeah, very nice. Okay, all right, here's the pantry. Very right. nice. With the drawers. Yes. Love that. I do. Got four of them there. Yes, ma'am. Very pretty. Yes. All right. We're going into the bathroom here. Has a All nice right. pocket door. Nice Let's one see. piece fiberglass shower front With the line. Seat. Not a huge shower. Definitely not a small shower. Andre, it really does get the job done um, in a motorhome this small. You know what I'm saying? Yes. I mean, it's, it's pretty nice. Right over here, we do have a toilet in a great place. It is porcelain. Andrea, do you even know what we call this? What's that? This is a prime poop position. <laughs> Bing! Very nice. And then Andrea, show us this nice medicine cabinet. Yes. Look at that. Adjustable shelves in there. Oh, yeah. We've got three drawers. Is it all of them? Okay. Very nice. Uh, cabinet underneath the sink. Yes, ma'am. I like the modern uh, faucet. And okay. what's this? Oh! Hey, liquefied. That's our brand of black tank chemical. Andrea, we've linked yes. it down below. You can get it exclusively on Amazon by going to primepoopmusician.com. We appreciate everybody who's been buying it, putting it in their black tank, and thinking and, about and us when they poop. And don't forget, you guys, to review it, too. Yeah, we need five stars on Amazon. Thank you guys so you know, much. You know, Andrea, coming into this bedroom. Good entryway. A benefit about being on YouTube is we have a brand that is popular from the beginning. Yes. A con is... There's a lot of competitors that watch us too, and they've been leaving us some negative reviews on Amazon. So we, we need to fill that with five-star reviews. This is interesting here, the adjustable shelf. But don't leave a five-star review if you haven't tried it yet. Right, we really what want we're trying to, to say, try it. We want honesty and Exactly. Um, nice insignia TV there. That's how there. we built our business, and that's how we will keep it. Yeah. Yeah, truth and honesty. <laughs> or bribes and treachery. <laughs> Yeah, right. <laughs> right there. And then over here, look. Okay, so there's three drawers on this side and then three drawers on that side and then some more storage right there. So that's pretty cool. I think I'd rather have the drawers, though, in the middle. I'm just okay. saying. If Fleetwood left a bag of money under the bed, all of a sudden there'd be no dislikes about this motorhome, now would if there? If Fleetwood wanted to give me a frontier i would say yes <laughs> i you know i'm you know, very partial Andrea, 
We don't take bribes. No, but I'm very partial. To but if it. we were offered a bribe, maybe we would. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so that was a stackable washer and dryer. Matt and I got off track, guys. We've got a nice closet here. Good size. And then over here, a nice king size bed. Very pretty. Yes, just uh, cozy storage. windows, speakers here. And then we've got some storage above the bed here as well. And I believe, yeah, I don't think you, yeah, you could do a CPAP because yep. there's the hole there. Yep, exactly. Other side is the same. It also gave you little tiny nightstands here with uh, electrical outlets. And USB. And oh, there's a generator start there. I like that. Nice. And then the bed does tilt up. Yes. And, and then hold this. There's no storage under there. Not on a tilt the bed. All right, Andrea, you know what you're talking about. Well, Andrea, that's it. That's the review. Now, before everybody leaves, oh, it is time we give people three things we love about it, three things we dislike about it. Andrea, what do we do first? Matt, this is tough. I'm going to just, I want to do the dislikes. Let's do, let's get them out of the way. Okay. I actually have two on the outside. Andrea, dislike number one for me. I love the storage. I love the doors. I cannot believe there's not a uh, slide out tray on this unit. I don't know if that's an option or whatever, but truthfully, it shouldn't be an option. This should be standard if, to come with a slide out tray. Andrea, that's dislike number one. What's dislike number two? Dislike number two. What is that, Andrea? Very little space to get through here. Yes, when the slide out is closed, it is yes. very, very tight. Try walking through. Okay, this so, way, this way. Oh, yeah. Well, I mean, that, right, that, that's fine when you fine, get there. But this, I definitely have to move to the side to get through. Yes, ma'am. So it is uh, doing the Macarena. Doing the Macarena in here. Yes, ma'am. Yes. That's dislike number two. Let's wrap it up with dislike number three. Okay. Great. Andre, do you have a third dislike? Okay, Matt, this has really been tough for me. I've been looking the whole time. Yep. And I will say, uh, I don't, for me, I prefer the dwarves. Okay. Um, I don't know why. I would just like the drawers better. Maybe Perfect. Bigger drawers in the middle. That's a great it's, dislike. It's very hard. Trust me, it's very hard for me to pick the dislikes in here. I'm gonna combo that, Andrea. I don't understand what this step's doing right, right. there. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like, it doesn't make any sense. Why is it not flush right there? I don't know. Because of the slide, maybe? I don't know. Rich. I don't know. Me no no. Okay. Well, Andrea, that's three things we dislike about it. Now for the easy part, now this for the fun easy. part. What three things we love about this motor? Oh, kitchen. Kitchen Talk is to me. beautiful. Yes. I love the colors. I love the decor. I love the solid surface countertop. Just very, very pretty. Love that. That's number Easy one. on the ice. Andre, number two? Number two is going to be the dinette. Talk to me. I will say it every time. I love these dinettes. What I love about them, like I said, it's really comfortable. Yep. But not only that, when you do make it into a bed, it's very easy. Yep. You would just push this, put that down, and slide it across. No plain Tetris with the pillows. Love the that. Cushions. That's number two. And then Andre, number three, I'm going to say the floor plan being 34 feet long. But not only that, the interior decor colors and choices. Mindy does an absolute fantastic job. Andre, at the end of the day, this is a small diesel push. It is. But the light colors in here really complements it and works well. And I just think they did a great job. Well, Andrea, that's it. That's the review. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys are interested in getting this Fleetwood or any Fleetwood, please go to mattsrvreviews.com, fill out the contact tab, or generalrv.com slash mattscash. I've linked it down below, or call 844-969-4033. Andrea, however you got to get in contact with us, we sell Fleetwoods nationwide, and we will be able to get everybody the absolute best price in America. Andrea, what do you want to say? Hey, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. Let us know the three things that you like about this RV and the three things that you dislike. Yes. Fleetwood does read the comments and they do watch the videos. So make sure you leave your feedback. I hope you guys are safe and well. Thanks for watching. Thank you. Absolutely, everybody, so much for watching. And Andrea, we'll see you next time.